Hi everyone, it is so good to be with you. And this happens to be Monday of Holy Week. On this first day of Holy Week, life is giving us a lot of reasons to worry. Uh, we might worry about whether justice will be done in the trail, trial of uh, Devin Chauvin. We might be worried about how people will respond, whatever verdict the jury brings. Uh, we might be worried about some places where the virus, the COVID virus, has been accelerating in its spread again. The Bible has a really good anecdote. Philippians 4, 6, 7 says, Be anxious for nothing. But in everything, by prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God and the peace of God, which surpasses all understanding, shall keep your hearts and minds in the knowledge and love of God. So we turn over our concerns to God and we trust God to act. And we also offer ourselves to act along with God in whatever way God might ask us to. So, for example, if we're worried about what's going to happen from Minneapolis, we can be sure in our sphere of influence to practice justice and fairness. And when it comes to the COVID and the, um, the upsurge that could happen with that, and it's already happening on the East Coast, and we're getting our vaccine and wearing our masks and being vigilant about all of that, and we can worry about, can we go out? Can we do this? Can we do that? It's, we really just need to entrust our lives to God and open ourselves up to God. and. You know, Jesus came to lift our burdens, that our burden might be light. And so we invite you to lift your worries to God, that that worry burden might be lifted and God might take hold. This is one week for sure when we reflect upon where things can head. So we enjoy being with you on this Monday and look forward to being with you on Wednesday. Take care and God bless. Goodbye. Bye.